If you, if any of you, either Israelite or an alien living in Israel, <clears throat> present a gift for a burnt offering to the Lord, either to fulfill a vow or as a free will offering, you must prevent, present a male without defect from the cattle, sheep, or goats, in order that it may accept, be accepted on your behalf. Do not bring anything with a defect, because it will not be accepted on your behalf. It must be perfect. <coughs> hmm, interesting. Perfect, spotless. Hmm. Um, what's a free will offering? It means it's an offering you did because you felt like it, not like you made a vow saying you would do it. You just sporadically did it. Yes. Do not offer the Lord the blind, the injured, or the maimed, or anything with warts or festering or running sores. <coughs> Yes. You may, however, present as a free will offering an ox or a sheep that had deformed or stunted, but it will not be accepted to fulfill a fulfillment of a vow. Like so. Like a little shorter or something, not like. Yes, just a little bit weaker or something. Yes. When a calf, lamb, or goat is born, it is to remain with its mother for seven days from the eighth day on it will be acceptable as a offering made to the lord by fire do not slaughter a cow or a sheep and its young on the same day yes so all the Rules of offering. Any questions? Ancient Egyptian Bible and um, Mike Winger usually answer questions. So, good, two good sources for there. Yeah.